Oh, hello there. Hello, YouTube. Me again, Papadopoulos, and as you can see, I got a bucket. And some more stone. As you can tell in my last video, last little sod video, I created a efficient, a, well, not efficient, a infinite furnace. Somewhat infinite. And, it, man, pretty much since this video, since that video has started, I've been playing for a while and it's still going. Uh, of course, I moved the chest up and this works just as great. And I got a lava bucket. So, look, three buckets. Yeah, look. Four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven, twelve. I made twelve buckets. Don't normally like doing it, but when I decided to switch over to this side, found a diamond. But I also found a mine, like right here. Well, not a mine, a lava pit. So I, I took out all that lava. And I placed it in this little cellar. And so, so I pretty much have a, a almost infinite amount of fuel source. So I don't have to use my coal so I can make more torches. Yeah, that's very nice. That's what all these buckets were to move those quicker. Another chest for blocks when taken apart. And I put these trap doors so that I don't accidentally just fall down there. So, yeah, that's what's new. Got some. I, I took out all the iron and coal in there on the ones already done. Got a lot. Smelted, and I got a lot of iron over a stack. And then, as you probably was able to tell, I got a full set of armor now. So I'm happy about that. Turned them into the block, and got that going. So that's what's new. I placed these to indicate where diamonds are. And I'm not going to get the diamonds until I get a fortune pick, which, as you can see, uh, as you can see, I only have 28 levels. So, waiting to get about 30, so that I can enchant. But in the meantime. I'm going to make some sugar cane for the books because I'm not going to go with any one or two level enchantments no I'm going to the full 60 uh, now nah, what am I talking about 60 I'm in 30 I'm doing the full 30 enchantment so let's see where the Sun is all right honey another thing I also started was a long canal that I'll put the sugar cane around which I might as well get that started boo -doo -boo -doo. Man. Yeah. and there we go so I'm just trying to extend that out I'm trying to deal with this little lag sorry my computer isn't all that good Here new. Right. Out. Alright. Ah, I hate that. There we go. And there we go. Now we have a channel to put our sugar cane in. And so hopefully I could get that going pretty quickly because I'm only two levels away so I need to go out looking for some cows or something 
and as you can, as if you remember, I have pigs over there, and if only pigs gave you leather, pig skin, yeah. But no, sadly it doesn't. So, All right. And also, I'm running out of wood, so I'm going to need to plant some trees. All right, never mind. Alright, let's get some of these saplings going after I eat. That eaten, 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 I don't know. Alright. Will it grow by itself? Let's find out. If so, that would be great. But I've been told that you have to have it next to a torch. So let's just get these down. And yeah. Later on I'll start taking down all these houses. Sheesh. 25 frames per second. It's just ridiculous. Grow. Oh, you know what? I have some bone meal. I have some bones. No, not in here. Alright, let's get two bones. And let's get this axe. I'm going. No, yes, there. Oh, it's gonna be. Are you serious? That took over six bone meal. I'm sorry for yelling. But come on, that's ridiculous. Just ridiculous. Alright, I'll put one more bone at least. Alright. Uh, plus the sun's about to go. You better get inside. Yeah? What are you selling? Oh, no. Maybe. Okay, that's real ridiculous. Nine bone meal, really? Yeah. Let me sleep. Alright, well. Let's see. For those of you who... One of the reasons why I did that video 3.5, where I just, it's just a speed up version of me mining. Yeah, that's boring and really no point. But the thing is, some people will like to know how others mine. And, well, this is how I mine. And the only reason why I see stone when I clearly have gold. I, well, what is this gold? I mean, when I have butter. And iron. The reason why I use stone is because it, it I use it as a measuring stick. It tells me how far I need to mine. Just a little little thing I do because with the iron or diamond, yes, you can keep mining, but you can also. What if there's diamonds here and you're mining like right here, going on forever? Well, you'll never get to these. So, it kind of gets to the line where when do you stop going and start a new section? Well, I use this as a measuring stick. What am I doing? Bring that there. So, it's just one of those things. You'll, once you start mining or whatever, or if you start improving to mine, uh, this is something you can always do. Uh, it's something to know. Uh, yeah. I try to keep it like this no matter what. I am, it's obviously going to be a little off the dirt. You have to mine out of the way with a shovel instead of a pickaxe. Because even if you use a pickaxe, it's going to make it off balance because 
mining up dirt is going to take up more of a damage. And then right here, I have to use iron to break it. So I'm like two blocks further than I would be, but you know, you kind of just stop caring after a while. Alright, let's see. I need to get this lit up. This going. And then what I do is, well, in this situation, I will just have to. Uh, I just put this up here. So, a little madness of mine. You don't have to, but. I like to have it where not each one of my mine mine tunnels is clear. So and I don't think this is gonna be enough. I think I'm gonna have to grab some more. So let me get this laid down. And yep, no, not gonna be enough. Alright, let's see. Just go in here, check up on this. That's oops, back up. Let's take let's just take a whole stack. <laughs> oh, and I put these doors because sometimes this isn't lit enough. Uh, so monsters will spawn in there and this just makes it even more safer to mine. Uh and yeah and then eventually I'm going to take out all the seriously all right eventually I'm going to take out all the torches in there so I can reuse them and then I just keep the doors on there turn them into iron so makes it <laughs> where they can't come on they cannot destroy it Uh, scary. Alright, let's, no, let's move this torch about right there. Move this down there. And continue to mine. Yeah, this, it gets boring. <laughs> so. And with the lava pool, lava pit, I don't always, oh, you shouldn't always move all the lava that you see because depending on what level you are on uh, you're going to come across a lot of lava so try and move a lot of lava several times it's going to get annoying you're not going to get a whole lot of progress at that point it's just best to keep like a lava pit or make your own like I did so you still have a lava a fuel source but on the rest, you could just fill it in with dirt or sand, the or just the best thing. You shouldn't really come across a whole lot uh, at level 10, which I am at right now. Or even if you do come across it, you're at the top, so you're not digging right into it. So. And then at which point you, it's safer to take the lava. Alright, once I get this picked down, I'll end it. Oh, see? More diamonds. That's what I'm saying. This is a good method to do. Yeah, enough diamonds. I, I don't care. This is what some people say. Oh, you get a lot of diamonds. Or you watch these videos where... They're just using diamond tools like all the time. And I never understood how they got the diamonds while well, they make videos about this. But this, <laughs> yes, let's find diamonds more, but you don't find that many diamonds as much as people have. I saw, I was watching a video where this guy has a double chest filled with uh, pick diamond pickaxes. Then another one filled with diamond swords, and another one filled with diamond armor. It's like, seriously, you gotta be doing something different. 
or just wasting life out on these mines, which I'll probably end up knowing. Diamond, shame bright like a diamond. Alright, well, let's get this all hooked up. And like I said, I, with the furnace, I was watching this other kid's uh, video called Nylon Plays, and which he's pretty cool. You go, should go check him out. Um, and he he made a little thing like this. He had the top of the furnace, and then that pointing down at a chest, which then he has to have holes in the wall and other stuff like this. But this way you can have. Sorry, this way he can have this on the ground like this, this mid level where it's at eye level and looks nicer than this at the top. Then he can have his roof like normal. So please, if you can, like this enough or share it so that Nylon Plays can see it. Because if he can see that, that would just be awesome. He's one of my favorite Minecraft YouTubers. So. If you haven't checked out his channel, go check it out. Oh, lag. Alright. Well, I guess I'll see you next time. Later.